YouTube Shorts getting zero views. I started posting shorts two weeks ago, and I've done all right. I have 71 subs, and one of my shorts has 6.1 thousand views. But some of my shorts, including my recent ones, have zero views. I personally don't think the content is that bad. I know my opinion doesn't matter, but people have commented saying my stuff is funny, etc. Why is that I'm getting zero views on some shorts? So this is because you literally just started your shorts page. And I know that because you only have 71 subs right now. Because you just started your shorts page, the algorithm does mostly work on luck when it comes to the beginning of your journey. So, for example, I can post a video about the sun exploding on two separate channels, and one channel can get zero to like ten views, and the other one can instantly go viral. It's still unlikely for it to go viral, but in that beginning phase of when you first created your channel, that is when YouTube is testing who your content is for and who it should push it out to. So in this case, what I would recommend is for you to keep posting your videos, assuming you're posting high quality videos, keep posting those videos on your channel, and over a period of six months, you're definitely gonna see your views go up. Your views can't stay zero forever. And there's no point in sitting around and being depressed, being like, oh, I have zero views. Yeah, well, that's just how the algorithm works in the beginning, unfortunately. The, the only way you can fix this issue is by posting high quality content and just not giving up. Now, I'm gonna show you an example of two channels that I made posting the exact same content. So here is a perfect example of what's going on. I know that this video has more than zero views, obviously, but it's the same concept. So this channel, it's called Man of Steel, posted this video, Meteor Falls from Sky, call on camera, and it got 16,000 views. And the audience retention is over 100%, which is good. This is the exact same video on my main channel, Insane Patient 2. It got 2.3 million views, same video, Meteor Falls from Sky, caught on camera. And as you can see, just like the other channel, in the beginning, it didn't pop off, it was getting barely any views. And then around March 7th, that's when the video started popping off. And I got over $133 from it. And see, same audience retention, over 100%. So the lesson here isn't that it's the alg- I mean, it kind of is, but the algorithm is, in the beginning, like I said, testing your videos to see who to push it out to. And when you post a large volume of high-quality content for a long period of time, the algorithm really knows who to push your content out to and who your audience is. And then what happens is when it figures it out and it sees that you post good videos, which consistently get over 100% audience retention, what it does is it says, oh, okay, so now I'm going to push out this person's older videos to the same group of people. And then if your videos are good, they're going to explode just like this. The difference between these two channels is not the content, is not the algorithm. The difference is I posted continuously and didn't give up on this Insane Patient 2 channel. It depends on what the content is. If you have compelling video titles and content, and if it's properly tagged, ignore that, tags don't matter, so people can find it in YouTube sh search. Also, if it's on a trending or relevant topic, can help the views too. Trends definitely help. Uh, get views, but they don't keep people to stick around and to really love your content. They don't build loyal followers. Also, go back to that short that did really well on your channel and see what made people like it. Keep doing more of what you did in that one. Eventually, people will subscribe and check out your other work. 
One thing I've learned about YouTube is success and getting a lot of views is completely random and even has a little luck to it. So I say create what makes you happy and don't focus on the numbers so much. So I kind of agree with him. Yes, create what makes you happy and don't focus on the numbers so much in the beginning. Focus on fun in the beginning and see if you actually want to continuously do this for at least six months. Now, when he says it's completely random, in the very beginning, it is random because you can have a video pop off on one channel, but the same video won't pop off on the other channel, like I just said. But... Success in the long term is not random. That is completely up to you. It's completely in your control. And look, this isn't the first time that I've popped off with this same content. Let's take a look at my TikTok. I have almost a million followers on TikTok and millions upon millions, well, not my recent videos, but I had millions upon millions of views. I still get thousands of views and hit a million views. Like, this isn't random. This is the exact same content that I'm posting on YouTube Shorts, but only repurposed on TikTok. And I'm still going viral. No matter if it's YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, even Twitter, these algorithms generally work the same. Sure, you can pop off on one sooner than the other, but in the long term, if you do this for at least six months to a year, you should see massive results if you're doing the right things on all of these platforms. Even on Facebook, I'm posting the exact same content, just repurposing it. And look, I have over 100,000 followers. So you can't say that this is luck. Multiple times that I've proved that it's not luck. I feel like shorts are different. I had one that had gotten zero views, so I privated it and re-uploaded it with copy paste everything and it performed average with the other videos I've put out, out in th the thousands of views. Look, never, don't private your videos, don't delete your videos, then re-upload them. All that does is it tells the algorithm that the video's crap and then the algorithm's like, oh, okay, this guy's posting crap videos and then you're less likely for your videos to get pushed out to new people. So if you see your videos doing poorly, I know it's discouraging, but the only thing that you can do to sort of make up for that is to post high quality content for a long period of time. Just keep posting high quality content. You know it's high quality if it has over 100% audience retention, or at least around 100%. It's so annoying when you get zero views because that means that YouTube showed your video to zero people so they can't even know if it's good or bad. I get that it's frustrating, but we all have to deal with it. It's an algorithm thing. You have to use tags, make good titles, and post at least once a day. When it comes to tags, just put like three tags that are related to your video that you come up with off the top of your head. Don't even bother like stressing out about them. Make good titles. Titles definitely can help, but they're not as important as consistent high quality videos. Post at least once a day. Post at least once a day if you can manage high quality videos once a day. Don't sacrifice quality for quantity unless you're posting less than three times per week. So a good balance would to be posting at least three times per week, three high quality videos per week. I definitely didn't get to the point in my YouTube Shorts journey where I was posting one video per day. Same problem for me. My first short got nearly, I think he meant to say nearly, 50k views and a decent amount of likes and comments, but now the rest I upload have one or even zero views. I think YouTube is becoming like TikTok, pushing your first video to keep you on the platform, then binning the, your next ones. YouTube and TikTok have no real reason to do that. It only serves them if you're posting good content and getting a ton of views because obviously you're keeping people on their platform. All they want at the end of the day is for people to stay on the platform. I would love to see what this guy's audience retention is because he's probably getting audience retention below 30%. And he probably has only been posting for like a month or less. Those are usually the people that are complaining about this issue.
It sucks I've made 100k plus views first month of uploading every day and then March hit and now I get zero views on my shorts. I don't know what happened. This person's style could have changed, he could have been posting the exact same dry content, or it's simply because he hasn't been doing it for long enough. You can't really judge how well your channel's doing unless you've been doing it for over six months. Then you can objectively take a step back, have a look at your channel and be like, okay, what's working and what's not? Just remember though, we're rooting for you, little bro.